What's up, CMS? Welcome to the Friday Five. I'm Elise. And I'm Becca. Students interested in joining the CMS yearbook staff, there will be a meeting on September 27th after school in room 240. Applications to join Student Council are due today. Please turn in your packets to Ms. Burry or Ms. Mullen by the end of the day. Let's toss it over to Evan for sports. Ow! Hey Chargers, it's Evan here with your sports update. As I mentioned last week, the co cross country team retained the nine mile belt against Millennium. Check out some of the, the highlights. On your mark. Let's go South Island! Let's go Mustang! On your mark. On your mark. Sports are very popular among the students at CMS. Our very own Riley Welton went out and asked a few students which sports are their favorites. I'm Riley Welton reporting for the Friday Five and today I'm going to ask students what their favorite sport is. This is Jenna and Jenna, what's your favorite sport? I like doing dance. Why do you like doing dance? I like doing dance because it's fun and I really like to like do turns and leaps and yeah. This is Evan and Evan I was wondering what's your favorite sport? My favorite sport is soccer. Why is it your favorite sport? I've been playing since I was six years old. This is Andrew and I was wondering what's your favorite sport? Uh, football. Okay, why is it your favorite sport? Um, because you get to do, um, it's not more than just like tackling a quarterback, you get to like sometimes run the ball, interceptions, and like anything else, really. Reporting for the Friday Five, I'm Riley Welton. The South Line East homecoming football game is tonight at 7 p.m. That's all for sports. Elise and Becca, back to you. Thanks, Evan. It's now time for the Creativity Corner with Eleanor. Welcome to the Creativity Corner. Today I'll be telling you some ways to relax before something stressful like a test. Number one, you can do breathing exercises. There are lots of these online. Also, the most important thing is you should study. Studying will make you more confident for the, for the test. The next thing you should do is you should power pose. One is the Wonder Moment pose. The fourth thing I was going to tell you is you can also make fidget spinners. Fidget spinners really help you to relax. Here's how to make your own fidget spinner. First, you have to get a shape. You can trace your own fidget spinner or you can just use a template online. You can cut out a piece of cardboard or use a paper plate. Now um, to make the spinner you need to use a toothpick and glue. Cut the toothpick and then stick it in the spinner and you can add the bearings. For the bearings what you do is you add, um, you need to cut out two extra circles out of the plate or the piece of cardboard and you put it on the fidget spinner. To make it spin better, I put three pennies on the end so it spins faster. Don't forget to drop off your designs for the Creativity Corner in room 231, and you could be featured on the show. Thanks, Eleanor. It's time to check in with Juice and Q to see which class will be selected as the class of the week. Hey, everyone. The class of the week is... Judy! Yeah! <laughs> Congratulations to Ms. Jordette for winning Class of the Week. It's now time for Kicking It with Sasha. Kick it! Hi everyone, I'm Sasha Stoyanovich and this is Kicking It with Sasha. The 33rd annual Pumpkin Fest in downtown South Lyon begins at 6 p.m. on Friday through Sunday and holds all sorts of fun events. Some events are the parade, where 200 floats are going to be a part of, live music, flying dogs, a pie eating contest, and dancing. By the way, Big City Dance Center will be performing on stage on Saturday, which my younger sister Sophia will be a part of, plus many more events. There will be games, bounce houses, and shows. This festival brought over 50,000 people last year because this is an event you don't want to miss. I'm Sasha Stoyanovich reporting for the Friday Five, and this has been Kicking It with Sasha. That is all for the announcements this week. Stay tuned for Mal and Ryan as they will announce this week's Blue Slip winners and staff shoutouts. I wonder what Mal's story is going to be this week. Have a great weekend, everybody. We'll see you next Friday. Every week, Malachi has an amazing story of how he got the Blue Slips. What's your story this week? Well, it's a really funny story. This week, I found myself in New Orleans where I was accompanied by a voodoo priestess named Pearl. 
After an, ep an epic battle between good and evil, I was able to vanquish the Swamp Witch by reciting the uh, Justin Bieber lyrics in a French accent. Quite a funny story. The Blue Slip winners are Lily Tinian, Landon Hartman, and Evan Hager. The staff shout out goes to Mr. Ross because he's very funny. Remember, Chargers, have a blue slippy weekend.